Alright, let's go ahead and get started. My sections are about this large. I did do square sections and my hair has already been moisturized with coconut oil, Jamaican black castor oil and all of that. So that's why it looks shiny. So right now I'm just going to start off with a regular three strand braid and I'm going to go down about halfway down my hair. So that's how much hair I have left and now I'm going to add to the hair and I'm going to use human hair for this install. I'm using Nadula Hair Company, the Brazilian Curly. I only used one bundle for my entire head and it is 26 inches long but when you fold it, it is much shorter. So try to get the longest bundle you can find. And so of course it's on the weft and now I'm just cutting off a section of the hair off the weft. And if you notice when you cut off wefted hair, it is a lot thicker towards the weft because that is where some short hair is to add volume. So I'm just going to comb that out to get rid of those short pieces that would eventually shed on your head. So you don't want that. So definitely make sure you comb the short pieces out. And now I'm going to take the hair kind of folded with more hair on one side than the other and I'm going to add it to the rest of my three strand braid. So I'm going to go in real time and really slow right here so you guys can see exactly how I am attaching it. This is definitely better shown than explained. And I hope you guys can really see what I'm doing here. Um, attaching it I guess would be kind of like the hardest part. But once you get the hang of it, it's super easy. And then I'm just going to continue to braid with the attached human hair. And then once I get down to where my real hair is a little short, I am going to add some human hair to it to make it longer. And then I'm going to continue to braid all the way down to about one inch past where my real hair ends. Now for the faux locks, I'm using the Bobbi Boss Bomba Soul Locks. I got the 12 inch length, color number one. I used three packs. And the reason why these locks work for this is because they are open at the bottom. So if you guys can see there, these locks are open at the bottom and that is why this method works for these locks only. I do know of a couple alternatives, but these are gonna be your best bet for this method. So. What I'm doing right now is what I have been doing on this channel. I'm just going to individually crochet on the base of this braid. If you guys need more help with this, I have tons of videos on my channel that can help you in greater detail and I will link some videos down below. So for these locks, I did something a little bit different. Once I got down towards the end, I actually left half of the human hair out and then wrapped the rest all the way down. So basically, it just kind of adds like a, if you guys know what tree braids are, it kind of just adds like a tree braid effect at the bottom there just to add a little bit more volume at the ends instead of all the hair just coming out at the very bottom. Just having a little bit hanging off the side at the top there, I think it just adds to the messiness, adds to the bohemian vibes, you know. That is what I did for the majority of my hair. So all the hair that I am not holding in my hand, that is how I did it. And now for the hair that I am holding, which is only about nine locks, I added a little bit extra to the top there. I'm gonna show you how I did that. Once again, I only did that to like that front nine section right there. Basically just took the crochet hook and put it underneath the base of the braid and then grab that hair on the other side. It is folded in half. And then I'm gonna crochet that and make a knot kind of underneath the faux lock. And then tighten that there. And then since I want it to come out of the top, I'm gonna to go in from the top, grab the hair again, close the latch hook and then pull it through. And basically I just kind of weaved it under there so that it can stay. And then it just adds just extra messiness, extra, you know, just the vibes. Y'all know what I mean. So yeah, messy goddess locks, whatever you want to call it. 
and yeah only did that for those pieces there and that is how the hair turned out I absolutely love this style and it's gonna be a lot easier to maintain because it is human hair that is all for this video I hope you guys enjoyed it if you like it make sure you give it a thumbs up and I'll see y'all in the next one bye